how this lecture started. Um, it comes out of my, uh, my years as the CEO of, uh, of Behringer or Behringer Blast Wine Estates, I think as it was called at that time. And uh, in, my, in my years as a CEO, uh, I came to believe that uh, one, of the, uh, one of the things that the industry, the wine industry did not do as well as they could is engage the, uh, the, the technical people, the winemaking uh, management and the viticultural management in the broader business opportunities and, uh, and problems that, that, any, that any winery uh, faces. So when I retired in early, uh, late 2004, early 2005, uh, my colleagues at Behringer, to my great surprise, um, had talked to people here uh, at, at UC Davis and, uh, and endowed a, uh, a fund to, uh, to create a, uh, a lecture series that talked about the business aspects of wine or the broader aspects of business. It's, it's obviously gone beyond that, but, but not the technical side of, mm -hmm. of, of, of wine, but the sort of the non-technical side across a wide range of, of functional areas. And, and, uh, you know, I was, I was so thrilled and, and moved to, to have had them, uh, have them do that. That initiated the, uh, the program in, in uh, 2006, I think was our, was our first lecture uh, that I did. Uh, uh, still, I think a record for being the longest lecture, which is probably why I haven't been back to do <laughs> asked back to do one again, and and has continued across a uh, you know a wide range of subjects and a wide range of of uh, of speakers uh, for 15 years now, and initially was a annual program, but uh, I'm assuming because of, hopefully because of the success uh, and interest in in the topics. Uh, it's become almost a band, almost an every year since 2011, almost a, a twice a year uh, event, uh, which uh, I, I'm very, very proud.